Here he is, the one, the only, the inimitable Kimbo Slice. No denying the power, no denying the mass appeal when Kimbo Slice makes the walk and competes in a high-profile MMA fight. The masses tune in. Yes, they do tune in. Some of the biggest nights the UFC or any organization has ever fought is attributed to Kimbo Slice. Yeah. He has an ability to just draw people in from the internet to the octagon. Kimbo Slice is always one of the biggest stars. Now. A lot of it is because of his personality. But they didn't pull up those Kimbo Slice videos to see him dancing. They pulled it up to see him fight. And Kimbo Slice, at his heart, at his core, is a fighter. No denying the power he has in both hands. He brings that to the table. And don't let the aesthetic fool you. Kimbo Slice might be the nicest guy on this roster top to bottom. Kimbo Slice is ready to engage yet again. Exciting man in mixed martial arts today. My fantasy football team is Team Gaethje. Justin Gaethje, since signing with the UFC a few years ago, has absolutely taken this promotion by storm. And he's only in main event. He's only in main event because you know, when you put Justin Gaethje at the top of the marquee, people will show up to watch in the arena, but they will also tune in on their television sets, on their computers, their laptops, on your PS4 or your Xbox, regardless of the console, People will show up to watch Justin Gaethje fight. All action fighter, has great wrestling, but it's his boxing and his leg kicks that has truly made him special to fight fans all around the world. Justin, the highlight Gaethje, steps inside the octagon. He's ready to fight. Or tell the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Alright, Herb Dean, third man in the fight. octagon for this one. Alright, every round begins on the feet, and that is music to the ears of one Justin Gaethje, arguably the most exciting fighter in mixed martial arts today, and he's gonna get after it, if that you can be sure. Alright, so a big early land by the boxer. He put a lot of steam on that one as he's able to get that hook on DC. He lands it perfect. I mean, he throws it perfect. Right hand is always where it needs to be. If he throws it with the right, the left hand's always where it needs to be. It's tight, it's crisp, and it lands with a lot of power. Hook to the head there by Gaethje. Alright, so we have got a full-on brawl start this fight any concern that these guys might burn themselves out oh they're going to exhaust themselves so we may as well enjoy it right now because come the third round regardless of the weight class they're going to look like two tired heavyweights in the middle of the octagon a big massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates All right, he's been very clean with his hooks on the feet here tonight, and it's the way he set it up that has really impressed you. Yeah, it's very impressive to see him pop the jab, pop the right hand, just touch, 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 and then boom! Oh! Ooh, diving punch, man! Oh, big, big 
couple shots here. All right, he continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Well, he's got his back now. That was nice. Pressure being applied here. In position for a submission attempt here. Oh, he's got the Kimura locked in. Oh, the submission defense holds up. He gets out. He said that he was ready for everything that would be thrown at him. In that position, he showed that and proved it. All right, gets inside, gets the single collar tie here. All right, so perhaps he's going to have to address something defensively. There is a legitimate cut around his eye. Yeah, he got cut on the eye from that last strike. He's got to pay attention now before it gets worse. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Final seconds here. Round two straight ahead. Stop, stop, stop. All right, so the round is over, but not before damage was done. Cut on the cheek, sustained it. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where... You ready to fight? You ready? Go All right, ahead. round two. That strike blocked by Kim Boschlitz. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Misses again with a right punch. Well, nice job by Gaethje to land and then roll with the punches. We talk a lot about his legendary chin, but maybe he doesn't get enough credit for the striking defense and his ability to move that head off the center line. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh, beautiful kick to the head. Oh, nice. Kimbo slices cheek. Looks like it's cut here. Starting to bleed a little bit now. Nice job by him defensively there. And a miss with the right hook. Just over three minutes to go. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here. In the oh, second oh, right there, DC, he's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. All right, well, he rocked him pretty good, but didn't sort of smell blood in the water, and now his opponent's back in the I mean, blood's in the water. You gotta go and get it. You gotta go find the finish. You cannot let him off the hook like that because now he will be motivated to try to go and hurt you as you hurt him. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is now he's got the blood to deal with. He's got a sharp striker in front of him. He has got a lot of things to deal with if he wants to win this fight. But right now, the focus needs to be on the head movement so you're not getting hit in that cut. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab. Point accuracy on that punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. Thirty seconds to go in the round. Kimbo slices. I'm starting to swell now. Fifteen seconds. Gaethje gets caught by that straight punch there. Ten minutes in the can. All right, 
So the fighters head back to the stools, and hopefully this fight can continue. That is a severe cut. We'll see if the cut man can do some good work here. All right, let us show you all that was done in terms of the damage in that previous round. He has got a huge gash on his cheek. I mean, there was that shot right there. That one landed and opened him up. What a nasty combination thrown by his opponent. But this cut now is another issue to deal with. Ready to fight. Ready. Third round underway. Do you believe it? This next round is underway. In the previous round, both fighters got rocked. Crowd going to oh, The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overy versus Ndanu. And you know they still haven't found Alex Overy's head. All right, so he's landed a few similar uppercuts already, DC. You got to think he goes back to it. I am almost certain he's going to go and try to find another one of those. But expect him to really set down and try to pick. Oh, that will go too. Back to the feet. Well, the cut man's getting excited, but nobody else is. That cut's getting worse by the minute. Every time he gets hit there, he gets a little bit messy. That was it. Justin Gaethje. Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 19 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Justin the Highlight Gaethje. Oh man, the human highlight film, right? I know that's Dominique Wilkins, but this is MMA's version. Justin Gaethje, your winner by knockout tonight. There's no one like him, Jay. I mean, there's no one like Gaethje. This guy is fun, he's exciting, and he's a die on his shield type of guy. And in most instances, he's the guy that puts his opponent out. Tonight, once again, he does exactly that. Knockout victory for Justin Gaethje.